Hello, uh, I'm going to show you guys how to change your ADS sensitivity settings in Rust or any other game really. Uh, as long as you have a Logitech mouse and uh, Logitech G-Hub. This may work on the older Logitech gaming software. Um, I'm not sure. I've only used it on... Uh, I've used a different script on that to get that to work and I can make a video on that if it's requested enough. Uh, but since uh, I got the new G502 Lightspeed, you're required to use G-Hub and um, they're not supporting Logitech gaming software anymore. I believe this is the new program that Logitech's going with, so this will be the future um, for Logitech. Um, anyways, uh, once you have Logitech G-Hub installed, um, I want you to click on Active Profile. It's going to open up a Games and Applications tab. Keep in mind, uh, as a disclaimer throughout this video, this program will auto-switch uh, to like if I click Rust Client here for the profile and then click off of the uh, window it automatically selects desktop again so now we're only making changes within desktop and that's not what we want you want to be making changes through Rust client um, profile so be aware that if it doesn't work for you the first time go back and double check that all these things are happening to this profile um, but if you don't see Rust Client also in this games and applications list, you can go all the way to the right and click Add Game, and you're going to want to search for the Rust EXE uh, in your computer files. Anyways, once we're here, we're going to go down to Profiles, and there's going to be a knob here called Scripting. Um, and, and again, when people think scripting, they think about recoil scripting or something that can get them banned through EAC. This will not get you banned. This is not something that's going to aim for you. This is just going to be something that changes your DPI to be lower while you're holding in your right uh, mouse button. And that's it. I've been using it for probably 1,700 hours. Um, and I have not been banned and um, nothing like that happening. So don't worry about that. Anyways, we're going to click on the scripting. And here, under Active Lua Script, it's going to say None. You're going to want to click that and hit Create New Lua Script. Uh, we're going to name it uh, ADS. You can name it whatever you'd like. The name here I don't think matters. You're going to click Edit Script. It's going to open up this new window. Under here, you're going to want to click and drag and clear all of that so that nothing's there. Now you're going to want to go into my description on this YouTube video and it's going to have the script that needs to be pasted in there. We're going to paste that in there. We're going to go up to script and hit save. Now we can close that window out. Now under active Lua script it's going to say ADS because that's uh, and that's what you want. Uh, after that you can just click the X here at the top and again we want to make sure we're on uh, the Rust profile because I clicked off and it was already selected here. So like I said, it does some weird things. But it does show, once we click on that under Rust, under scripting, that that's our active script. So that's good. So now under Macros, I want you to click on Add Macro. The name for this does matter. I'm pretty sure it's case sensitive. We're going to go DPI down, uh, capital DPI, and then a capital D. We're going to hit Enter. We're going to do No Repeat. Then we're going to click Start Now, go down to System, click Mouse, we're going to click DPI Down, and then hit Save. We're going to do the same thing, but for DPI Up this time, capital DPI, and then a capital U, No Repeat, System, Mouse, DPI Up, and hit Save. And now we're done. Now our macros... <clears throat> and our scripting is set up to be able to lower our ADS. The last thing we need to do is click on our mouse in this main screen here and we're going to go down to the sensitivity settings. Yours is probably going to be set up uh, to have a bunch of different sensitivity settings. Um, I recommend only having two so it's less confusing. Um, and I play normally default at 800 DPI. Um, so your higher one you're going to want it whatever you play default as. And then uh, your ADS sensitivity, uh, I like mine a quarter of the speed of what it normally is in Rust without doing this uh, method, so I have it at 200. Um, I also run 1000 hertz polling. Um, 
and from here that's it this num this one that says 200 is what you want to experiment with yourself to see what works for you for me my muscle memory it likes having that slower speed of 200 um, so just play around with it but you want to have two settings here and uh, from here that's that's pretty much it um, a quick disclaimer also I did not come up with this um, I found this through googling um, this method and I just decided to make a video on it um, the person who came up with this um, his name is uh, you bystander 36 um, he's from reddit um, so he came up with this or at least I saw his post and I just wanted to make the video on it and it works in any other game like I like I said before so um, and again uh, I'm new to making tutorials if you couldn't tell um, so if I went too fast or too slow or rambled too much, uh, just let me know in the comments. And if you guys have any issues, uh, let me know also, and I'll try to help you out if I can. Thanks.